Uh, my name is Julie, and this is my first video for YouTube. Um, I wanted to show you uh, this home remedy that um, actually my brother came up with it. He Googled it, or somebody told him about it. Um, so it's ground cloves and just water, and it uh, gets rid of tooth pain. Um, I have a bad tooth way back here, and the dentist didn't. Yeah, he sent me to the hospital, sent me home, didn't do nothing because he didn't know me enough. So whatever, he was. Here's me. Okay, so this is the um, ground paste, um, or ground clothes into a paste. That's what it looks like, and I'm going to show you how to make it. So we use ground clothes. So all you need is just ground clothes, and um, you can also put on your uh, your newborn, well, not newborn, but your baby who's teething. Um, you can put it on their gums. But um, I'm actually not sure. It will help, but um, I don't know if maybe if you should or not. Uh, you should ask the baby's um, pediatrician because they would know more about it. My son had colic, and we to get rid of colic, you also use peppermint extract. So I'm going to add a little bit of water to this. Um, oh, I put way too much. So if you put too much water, that's okay. You can just add more clothes or more ground clothes if you put um too much ground clothes just add more water i don't have measurements i just <sighs> i guess i just eyeball it so yeah <laughs> that needs way more clothes i mean i made i made a lot because it's just well i actually did a few videos and they didn't turn out right um hopefully this one will so just add a little bit more. I was doing it on plates, and some people don't like the sound of the plate noise, and I don't. I definitely don't, so plastic might be better. Um, okay, well, it's, yeah, it's, it's perfect now. Okay, so that, that's the paste. That's what it's supposed to look like. So you just smash it up. Make sure it looks exactly. Let's try to get into the light. So, like that looks like chocolate. Wish it was chocolate. It tastes nasty too. So if you don't like the taste, well, I don't know what to do. But I don't like the taste, but I don't like pain either. So if you don't want to deal with pain and you rather just deal with the nasty taste of it, but just try not to get some of it on your tongue. It will numb your tongue because it does mine. Um, then you take a Q-tip. Just a Q-tip, and then you just put it around your teeth or your gums, um, anywhere that's painful, to numb it until you can get to a dentist for them to check you out. Which I am gonna have to call because I'm too. I've been dealing with it for almost two weeks, and I can't deal with it anymore. And I hate the dentist really bad, but I I have no choice. So, I have. Oh. And I got some on my tongue. Ugh, it's name my tongue. And it tastes nasty. But it gets rid of the pain. Oh, so much. It gets rid of the pain. And I got I think I have like two or three teeth that's in pain or my gums. I'm not sure what, but I know I have a lot of pain back here. And so it looks like that. It's nasty. Ugh. Okay, so Oh, I didn't mean to get it on my tongue. Oh, it's so nasty. So, um, it's actually helping out the pain. So, uh, try this. It works. I get rid of your pain and call a dentist the uh, uh, following business day and get in. So, because if ibuprofen or any pain pills not working, because obviously it's not working for me, not ibuprofen, so, and it's 800 milligrams. Okay, well, this works. Alright, bye.